Charlie Cushain here. As you may know, I live down in Florida during the winter months, and on my house, on the south side to get sun all day, I had a plastic um, hose holder, which as you can see from the UV light from the strong southern sun all year long, weakened it and it finally broke. So today, I'm gonna replace this with a really, really nice Ely hose reel that will allow me to extend the hose anywhere I want and it's all made out of metal and very robust. So let's take this off and get started. Here we go, ready to mount the new one. All right, I purchased a new Ely hose reel and it was one of the most highest rated um, hose reel on Amazon. And I, I had one of these already on the front of my house, now I need one for the side. Um, it's a beautifully made um, all metal hose reel. So UV won't affect it. It has great brass um, union. And it's a very clever design where you can mount this to the wall and either have it go um, parallel with the house or you can have it perpendicular. So you can have it work either way. So let's start putting this together. Okay, the first thing the instructions tell you to do, and they're very, very nicely um, diagrams in the instruction manual, is put the two hose reels halves together. You lay one down, get the other half, put it on top, line it up, and they give you a wrench. An actual Allen wrench with two different size um, hexes. Then you just take the three screws and put it together. There. Perfect. Next thing you have to do is add the rotating handle. It's just a shoulder bolt goes through. Put the screw in. There we go. That's nice and tight. Okay. Then you decide which way you want this to go the parallel with the house so that's the way we're going to mount it and this you just take it flip it over and put some screws in and tighten down the screws there we go now this is ready to mount to the house and they give you all the hardware to mount it either to cement or to wood or over vinyl siding. Of course I'm going to go right into cement. So let's uh, take this outside and mount it. Okay the first thing I have to do is mount this in such a way obviously the bolts don't match what I had that'll hide those old holes like that. So I get that, put a level on it. And 
market. Perfect. Now I know where to drill. all drilled. Solid as a rock. Okay, time to start putting this together. First thing you do is you take the male end of the ho feeder hose, put it through. There we go. Take the hose reel, put the handle on the outside. on the inside then this is the brake that controls it okay then you attach the hose to this your hose, get it through the strap here, and through this hole, tighten it onto this. There we go. that. Now, we tighten this strap. on this strap and not on this joint. Time to wind it up. Winds up great. Okay, here's a good look at the Ely hose reel, all mounted. As you can see, no leaks at all in the union or where the hose attaches. 
and this is a good look at the brake so you can undo the brake and it'll unwind however you want or you can adjust the brake to be as tight as you want to restrict unwinding but that's what it looks like came out beautiful and that will definitely resist the wear and tear from the Sun and the UV light I love it 